So, um, I found this video online about this this young Nigeria businessman hustler. <laughs> that businessman they call her. Young boy, we go party. Because of food. Start to hustle food. Even I see the talent, so this boy they hustle one plate of food. Eh? When I go to starve with me, when we say the, this country is not for the weak. Eh? This country is not for the faint hearted. If you stay in Nigeria, you don't get power. The, you, you, the country is not meant for you. So, when I go watch this video, make it not be like, I'm me talk because. When I go talk now, people will say, I don't they talk about it. Even I see talent for this boy to take eat one plate of food. When I go understand what the Bible meant, when he said we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities and powers. Mona, watch this video. We are Mona, they see you. Now, this guy, where we are blue, now he won't really hustle the food. Mona, they watch you in the survey area. <laughs> he will get PA to survey. Now, that guy will sit down here and I PA. Uh, that guy, this guy, wasted and I repeat, I look at the help and wash. The, the help of God, they wash. And I see you, and I see you, and leaders of tomorrow. When I they wash. Watching his environment, international businessman, international standard CID, officiating over one plate of food. Yeah, see you, see you, see you. He doesn't have his slippers. In case when he pick the food, the cash out, he goes in as if as well. Oh boy, he does start us. He does start us. He does start us. Then he's mad. Even Slata are not doing this one. Clear way. Talent is talking. Mona, they say that leaders of tomorrow. This country is finished. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, boy. It don't ask you one plate of food. See celebration. Every year go soft. Shame on us here. When I see what they're talking about. When I see an international businessman. The way they make me laugh, as we say. The guy get paid for the hustle. He sees it and gets up on the way they group. That guy, that way they group. Now you go find that guy support here. Yeah. That guy is supposed to eat meat for the food. If not too many, the guy will collect the small one. Then he will be the chairman. They go collect the big one. Very funny. But, but you see this thing here. Yeah? Why we laugh about this? That problem with the look so. <laughs> that better problem with the look so. This is what is happening to most of the youths in Nigeria. Now let me explain what is happening here. This guy is supposed to be in school. Studying engineering or law or computer programming or something. Something that will help the country move forward. Something that will be a solution to people, solve one or two people's problem. But instead of him being in school, politicians have, politicians have squandered the, health, the um, education fund. So school are on strike. You cannot get proper education. If you check when I papa feel be somebody who don't work for one government um, organization before, pension hard to collect. So now they're not feed and well in the house, you know, go school, better food no day. So he's left to fend for himself and he doesn't know much. So this is what he knows and he's getting better in this. He doesn't even groom somebody. Now, you go do this thing for a while. You go find and say, don't be fooled, it's about the hustle again, you understand? Because why, why should you be hustling for when they are big artists to hustle? You go cost that to the hustle, laptop, phones, you go start to snatch cars. If you quick see gun, you go turn to kidnapper. When they kidnap you now, We'll start to pray for church, tell God to fire out the kidnappers, burn them by fire, they will die by fire, it will not be well with them. This is what we continue to go on. Meanwhile, politicians have their families abroad, they are living good life, going to good schools, there are so much food in their house, even politician dog, the food where the politician dog house, plenty pass all the food where that place where I one from Tiff one. These are the children that, Niger that God has given to Nigeria that are supposed to be a blessing to the country. They are gradually becoming a problem to the country. You see, whatever God gives you and you don't take care of it, we become a problem to you, even food. If God gives you food, you cook and put for pot, you don't warm them, you don't take care of them, you don't microwave them, it goes spoil. And then when it's spoil, not be only the house, only for spoil, go feel the heat. Even neighbors go perceive the odor. So you see these things you are grooming now, if you no concern you, but when they become big problem, it go affect all of us. A time is coming in Nigeria when the poor will revolt. Now you where they drive car, they go start to fight before they go see politicians. If we keep voting these people, if we keep doing tribalism, because I'm going to talk some Chris men go call my DM, my, 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 my videos, come they tell me, say, uh, these evil boys, will they, will they use Yoruba politicians, say they play. I'm not an evil boy. 
I'm a worry boy, but first and foremost, I am a Nigerian. If in 2022, what matters to you is the tribe of the person talking, then they need to carry your brain. Go exchange your passport. You understand? Because you're not really getting it. You're braided to If at this age, that tribe still, I don't care if the leader or the leaders of the country are from the north, the south, the east, or the west. I just want to be a Nigerian in peace. We're not asking for too much. Most of our guys, when they go abroad, not be saying they really get better money like that. But when they reach abroad, even if not cab that they drive, they will feel stay good house, decent one. They will feel send their children go school. They will feel eat. They will feel buy clothes. That is what Nigerians are asking for. Salary is 50,000, your ass rent is 1.2 million for a decent two-bedroom flat in Lagos. How do you want to achieve that? Or your salary, even if your salary is 200, how can you pay for a normal two-bedroom flat? And government is looking. The letter they expect people not to do Yahoo. Destroying the youth for us. We will throw them out. Everybody get your PVC or we can do this. We plenty pass them. The youth in this country are enough. We will throw them out. This nonsense will stop. God will dedicate Nigeria in Jesus' name, whether you like it or not. All of that, we shout amen. Mona, go get PVC because the Bible says faith without work is dead.